Valuable Player of the Game Award. Recently, Brent Musburger was on hand when Chevrolet presented their top honors for the season of 1985. Since the college football season began on CBS Sports in September, our commentators have selected Chevrolet most valuable players in each game. Chevrolet then donates $1,000 to the General Scholarship Fund of both participating schools for use by qualified students in their chosen academic fields. And annually, Chevrolet selects the offensive and defensive players of the year and the coaches of the year along with CBS Sports. And we're pleased today to be with Mr. Tom Stout, Chevrolet's General Marketing Manager, who will make the presentations to the award winners. Tom? Brent, thank you. It's always a special thrill to honor year-long excellence, both on the playing field and in the coaching ranks. And it's certainly rewarding to honor the coaches whose responsibility it is to develop leadership and excellence in our athletes. Well, Tom, the Division 1A Coach of the Year is Fisher DeBerry of the Air Force Academy. The 47-year-old head coach is only in his second year at Air Force. He led the Falcons to an 11-1 record, their best since 1958, when the team was 9-0-2, as well as a share of the Western Athletic Conference crown, the Academy's first ever. Now, his high-flying Falcons set school records for touchdowns and points scored, and they were one of three Division I-A schools to score at least 21 points in each game that they played this season. Congratulations, Coach DeBerry. You're coming out of a pressure-packed season. The training, guidance, and inspiration you gave your players resulted in their going all out to make this a very memorable year. Well, thank you very much, and I accept this award with sincere appreciation. I just want to take this opportunity to sincerely thank CBS and Chevrolet for their tremendous support to college football, and I accept this honor on behalf of our young men at the academy and our, my fellow assistant coaches uh, for the tremendous job they did during this year. They're the ones that really are deserving of this award, and I just appreciate them giving me the opportunity of pumping up the balls on Thursday afternoon before the game, but it is indeed an honor for everybody here at the United States Air Force Academy. Now it's time for the presentation of the Chevrolet Most Valuable Offensive and Defensive Players of the Year. Yes, Brent, and when you think of all the great performances we've seen all year long, to pick the one offensive and defensive player that stands out among all the others certainly had to be a great challenge. It really was, and our Most Valuable Defensive Player of the Year is defensive tackle Mike Hammerstein of the University of Michigan. Bo Schembechler calls his 6'4", 250-pound senior from Wapakoneta, Ohio, the best individual pass rusher ever to play for the Wolverines. For the season, Mike had 73 tackles, including 22 tackles for losses while sacking the quarterback nine times. Hammerstein was a consensus All-America, a Lombardi finalist, and one big reason why the Michigan Wolverines gave up only five touchdowns this last year. Mike, you're certainly most deserving of this award. And I should add that this trophy will be inscribed with your name on it and will go on display permanently at the College Football Hall of Fame in Kings Island, Ohio. Thanks. I'd just like to, on behalf of the Michigan team, the defense, thank CBS and Chevrolet for this award. I think it's uh, mainly a reflection of how well our team and especially defense played this year. We, uh, we came to play, we played hard, and we played good. And I'd just also like to thank CBS and Chevrolet for their continuing support in college football. Tom, certainly no surprise about our Offensive Player of the Year. He is running back Bo Jackson from Auburn, and Bo will add this prestigious award to his growing list of honors, which include the 1985 Heisman Trophy and the Walter Camp Outstanding Player of the Year. A consensus All-America, Bo rushed for 1,786 yards and scored 17 touchdowns in 1985. Wow, Bo, you've had an exceptional season and a spectacular career at Auburn. In your leadership, teamwork and outstanding individual performances have inspired teammates and fans alike. Congratulations on a great year, Bo. Thank you very, very much. And I don't think that I could have done this without the help of my teammates. And I would like to give thanks to Chevrolet and CBS for nominating me for this award because there's a whole lot of good people out there that work just as hard as I have. And I'm just fortunate enough to come out on top. Well, let me add my congratulations to all the award winners, and Tom, thank you very much for your continuous support of college athletics, plus financial aid to the students through the Chevrolet Scholarship Program. Long ago on the frontier, homeowner's insurance meant knowing the cavalry was close at hand. That kind of protection was hard to beat. 